What's up everyone? No, the title is not clickbait. We did indeed right. buy another car. It's the last song on the day, babe. You know Keep it going. Um, where's the new car? What the heck, it's not here. I've been waiting for over a year. I've waited years. Car, what do you mean it's not here? Okay, so you guys should try to decipher what car we're talking about here. So, over a year and three months ago, we made a reservation for this car. That's right, we placed a down payment on this car before we even really knew the specs, what it looked like, or really all that much about it. And now yes. we're still months out from being able to configure it. So if you don't know what car we're talking about already, you probably do, given that we're Tesla fanboys. Yes, it is the all new Tesla Model Three. There have been over 600,000 pre-sale orders placed on this car, but luckily we woke up bright and early and got on top of it the day it was released and yeah. placed our reservation among the very, very first people. So what that means is we are, just like you said, gonna be one of the first guys with a Tesla Model 3, which is awesome. And that's especially awesome because we of course have a YouTube channel and we'll be able to make plenty of videos documenting the purchase process, receiving it, everything you can think of. And that brings up the next point. We want you guys to help us decide how we're gonna configure this car. Now configuration is an interesting point. Christian talked about that a little bit. Yeah, that's right. So it sounds like right off the bat, they're gonna make it really simple so they can really crank them out and make all of them very similar. Like yeah. you, I think you just get to choose like paint color and mm. like what wheels you Rims. want or something. Regardless of what options are available, we want you guys to be with us every step of the way on configuration, receiving all of this good stuff. I don't know why we haven't made a video talking about this yet. It's been a year and three months. Like literally, I don't even think I've hinted at it. Maybe I've hinted at it once, some of you guys know, but so many of you guys don't know, and I think it's pretty exciting. I mean, this car is like the future. So that's pretty neat, and we wanted to at least inform you guys. So we've been thinking, the Tesla Model 3 has this one. It's so popular, but it's been in the works for like two years now. And meanwhile, some healthy competition has come along. This competition became really eye-opening when the folks over at Ted Britt Chevrolet in Sterling, Virginia handed us the keys to a brand new 2017 Chevrolet Bolt. Yeah. So we had that car for a day and we filmed some of our first impressions and some review bits and pieces of it. So for the next little portion of this video, we're gonna show you those clips we took last week of the car. Overall, it's uh, gonna be really interesting to see how Tesla will react to this new competition. And really our whole mindset of being a Tesla Model 3 reservation holder is kind of changed a little bit now. So anyway, here we go, let's roll the clips, enjoy. We are coming at you from the 2017 Chevrolet Bolt. There were hundreds of thousands of Model 3 pre-orders placed, but then out of nowhere released this, Chevrolet released this Bolt EV fully electric with like a lot of the same specs as the Model 3. Yeah. Similar range, even better perhaps, and uh, and similar price point. I've always had the, in the back of my mind that competition against Tesla has always been weak. Like everyone tries to make their electric cars, but they're never that great. So when the it, Bolt it, came out. Yeah, it seems like they try, but at the same time, it seems like a lot of manufacturers don't actually put their full effort behind their electric car lineups. It's just kind of a token thing just to do because they have to do it or should do it. This Chevy Bolt, on the other hand, seems like it has the full Chevy behind it. I bet you Tesla's like running scared straight. They're probably freaking out. They thought they had yeah. it. And now bef way before the Model 3's even released, here we are in yeah. a Bolt with 238 miles of range. Coming from the 60 kilowatt battery, which is on par with, with Tesla specs. I mean, no other car has had a huge battery pack like that other than Tesla. That's what Tesla's been known for. It's also interesting that I think this was released a full year before Tesla was even expected to release their Model 3. They're saying that deliveries will just begin by the end of 2017. And I mean, this thing was hitting the lots by, I think very late 2016. Yeah, like, styling isn't bad. I really don't want, like the way the i3 and a lot of electric cars look, Priuses and Leafs, but this is not bad. They Nowhere near a Tesla. The Tesla designs knock everything out of the water. But interior is not bad. Um, seats are very kind of thin and small. I mean, we're big and tall. Plenty of headroom. Whoa, but this it's like is unusual. Pretty cramped. Um, uh, media interface, 
pretty normal. Um, the cool connectivity to your iPhone is neat. Yeah, so right now I think this is Apple CarPlay. So we actually plugged in the phone to it. So we got that in sport now, open road. Let's give it a little punch. Oh, now we're coming stop. from a P90D ludicrous model, yeah. but let's see what we got. Okay. Okay. Someone who doesn't come from fast cars comes from like a Prius yeah. or something. That'll, that'll feel peppy. That'll put a smile mm -hmm. on their face. Zero and to 16 what? Was uh, it should be about seven seconds. Model That's not three. bad. Not so, bad at all. Range is the crazy thing. 240 yeah. miles, like Model 3 was supposed to have over 200. That was a big mm -hmm. thing for like under 40 grand. This is under 40 grand with tax um, deductions. You're like, what, just over 30 for a base car? That's yeah. crazy. Okay, boom, so there you have it. Our first impressions and review of the Chevy Bolt. Please be sure to comment down below what you think about A, the Chevy Bolt, how Tesla will take it, and B, what do you think about the Tesla Model 3 in general? Are you happy that we are getting one? All right, we will be keeping you guys updated on the journey of our Tesla Model 3 purchase and hopefully specking it out here soon. Yes. Be sure to like the video if you enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe if you're maybe a reservation holder or thinking about the Bolt or the Model 3. There's a lot more videos coming very soon. Hope you all enjoyed. We will see you in the next one. Take care.